All right, let's take a look at this here. Uh, thanks for all the notes. Um, I think it's very cool. I think the only thing that stuck out was this shot being a bit low in energy. I think the hookup is cool. But it's almost like she could turn just a tad faster and get there a bit, obviously, sooner. And then you could have, you know, that little ease in. And then she would like bomb more sharp return in the Y and a bit up. So it's kind of like a turn back and then up. And then realizing, oh, that thing is right behind me. And then it cuts to BOOM! And then maybe on that, just a slight reaction on her. She's a bit... But I don't know. It depends on your storytelling. Maybe maybe you don't want to. Maybe you want to, you know, save this for later. But there could be something neat. Just have a little bit of a reaction there. But I like how all that stuff is pointing towards her. That's pretty neat. This is really cool. I mean, I like all of this. It looks great. I think the hookup is great. I like your camera move. I would just go. I feel like you want to be overall framed a bit higher. There's something about this almost feeling. At times a bit too close to the top frame let me get to this here i don't know it's, just, it's a little thing it's totally subjective but i mean it is you know it is coming pretty low here so maybe it's not that bad that's just my initial reaction watch this first it's like hmm, maybe a bit bit lower and a bit less of a drop here i felt like that going down especially when you look at the spacing Boom! Suddenly she shoots up. So that just felt suddenly really, really harsh. And then the turn was a bit fast. I would probably not go further than this. And then on this shot, watch out. The hookup is weird. She's leaning forward and we're leaning back. Um, arm is back, arm is forward. So just the hookup is a bit weird. So I would just not go as far. Which has a really, really fast move right before the cut. <coughs> Excuse me. So I would just go maybe not further than this. Start this shot with the head a bit more towards us. And if there's anything you can do to make that hookup a bit more seamless. It's all really, really fast. So it's not like you massively notice it when you watch it for the first time. But still, maybe just something where you can just kind of cheat something. When arm is straight, goes back. You know, maybe we are in a this type of pose, arm-wise, you know, it almost feels like she, you can cut into this later, get into this, like that. The head is a bit more towards us, maybe double cut or jump cut a bit, but you know, maybe just something here. Imagine she cuts here, head a bit towards us, boom, and then by now she would have her head here. Does that? But that shot is cool. I love. Arm stuff is cool. There's just a little bit of moment here when you start hitting a very twinned W pose. Like offset that a bit more. Yeah, it's cool. Like a little stuff on the legs, steps. Yeah, I just suddenly felt like mm, that could have a little bit more complexity towards the end. A little pop up, a double turn. And maybe on, like I said, on that, on that, you know, tightening of the shoulders, arm goes up a bit more, just like a, a slight change. But it's kind of up to you. Now maybe you want it to stay like that. It's mostly about the foot, and I mean, she knows what's coming, and that's just kind of like, all right, I'm ready, type of thing. Um, but yeah, that's about it. So I think overall, huge progress. I like it. Little picky things on, on shot cups, but other than that, I think it's super cool. Thank you. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.